Come and join us at Sapphire Falls. We're going to go through all the perks and amenities that this hotel has to offer. Like the yummy food, the pool, ways to get to the park, and more. Now we have technically stayed at all the Universal hotels. I will link our playlist down below, but stay tuned as we will be revisiting some more soon. We typically find the cheapest dates being February, May, and September. Hey, all right, today we're at Sapphire Falls. Falls. Celebrating Buddy Boy's birthday. Yep. All right, we're gonna show you all the hotel amenities. We're gonna, what else are we gonna do, buddy? Eat. And? Oh yeah, we're gonna eat. Go to the pool. Yes. Yeah, check out the pool. It, it is heated. It is heated and it's 60 degrees here. <laughs> it's, yeah. yeah, it's like <laughs> And the pool is heated to 82, so let's go show you all around. Yep. All right, let's go. Seven. Let's go. I got a good view of the pool here. We're gonna go there in just a little bit, but I want, I do want to eat first. There's not a ton of people because it is chilly, but they did like the water slide over there. Yeah, it's, even, it's even, even the even the secure, even the life, lifeguards are have heavy jackets on. But it's heated to 82 degrees. So there's that, and there is a hot tub as well. Can we go in the hot tub? Yeah. 82 degrees? Yep, 82 degrees is what he said. Let's go check over here for the view because we have a lagoon view. And there's the pool this way. We're in guest house three. So this is guest house two over here. You can actually see the Hulk go by. But they did upgrade us. I'm excited to see we're in guest house three, which is probably over there. Yeah. And then that way we can see the lagoon and the water taxi, maybe even the Hulk. Or Dr. Doom. We didn't get this strong water tavern the one year we came, so I will put a clip clip in of that food and then we're gonna go eat at Amatista, which we have not eaten at. So I'm excited. They do have a little shop over here too. Like if you forget Tums or Tylenol, or I'm sure they have that in here. And oh, one time we did get the, um, what was it? Here. Yeah, we got some sort of ice cream. It was gelato or something, something like that. Like the kids like that. So we're gonna go to guest house three. Ready? Yeah, let's put it in your mouth. Okay. I had these. Okay. okay. So we got. Oh, there's a big back here. And yes. then two beds over here, so. Whoa, like, that's actually cool. Can everybody sleep over here? Wow. wow. <laughs> they upgraded us, guys. They gave us another room. Do you like it? Oh, Happy mom. birthday, buddy. This, this room is better than ours. Mom, can yeah. I sleep down where can I sleep this was here? our room? Sure, you can sleep there. I want to sleep, sleep on the left. So they got two little kid beds here. Uh, and can take oh, it off. Yeah, sit down there. You can come over here and she can She can write. Do her writing or even all her videos. Wow, and she can look outside. Look. Oh, look how pretty. You can at least look at that. You well, yeah, you can see the waterfall. The waterfall's right there. What? Water? I'll show it here in a second. And then they have dresser and the TV. And it looks like we're in a, uh, it's like a submarine My type favorite. thing. Uh, look. What? You take off your shoes. I can uh -huh. take off my shoes? Yes. Right here. Cool, we can spy on people going on a water yeah. taxi. We can see how long the line is. <laughs> yeah, we can actually be like, uh, well, well, we can go now. There's somebody there. <laughs> oh, this is nice. I well, like okay, it. Clear, get your, never mind. I like the view. It's really nice. We paid 170, which is pretty cheap for this because it goes to up to like 300 uh, for the off season. <gasps> yeah. So look at that. What's this? I got a little chair with a table, and then some Fiji. No, that's 750, so we're not touching that water. Yeah. And a nice big bed over here. You like it? Yeah. Is this so nice? Yeah. And then a coffee maker, the TV, what, they more have cabinet one space. So we don't have one bed in our room. You have, you have, you have a kid suite. Stand between the beds. That's pretty cool. And then, oh, I like the uh, bathroom area. They have a sink, is separate from the toilet, so that's nice. You can get ready. And then they have the shower, of course. We just kind of use the shampoo they give us. Just the typical. We're only staying one night here. We only need a little bit of each. 
Then of course they got a safe. Uh, they've got some hangers, iron, hair dryer, and some extra bedding. Jack wants to show the fridge and open it. There you go. We're gonna put our waters in there so they stay nice and cool. We can take them to the park tomorrow. Yeah. Even though it's not a premier resort with express passes, it's still a really nice hotel. We gotta go to level one for Amatista and the water taxi, but we were at level four. All right, so we are gonna try the queso fundido. And they have different salads. They are known for their rotisserie. I might try that because that sounds really good. They have a Beyond Burger fried chicken sandwich. Island fish. Yeah, there's barely anyone here. Island fish sandwich and a short rib burger. And then they do have flatbreads, which sound really good too. And lava cake, rum cake, sorbet, and mousse. And they do have like drinks and stuff too. Careful with that, buddy. So mocktails, wine. Chihuahua cheese and corn tortilla chips. Uh, corn chihuahuas. <laughs> okay, ready? Actually Get this. Okay. It's chihuahua milk. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that cheese. Let me know if it's spicy. There's um, a taxi. What? Water taxi. So it really wasn't spicy at all. I am a total wuss when it comes to this. I would get that again. All right. So I got the chicken fry or crispy chicken sandwich here it has uh chipotle sauce it has avocado cream with some coleslaw on it on a on a just a regular bun and there it is right there and i did get the rotisserie chicken which they're known for and i did put the sauce that comes on the side with yuca fries and then i did get plantains as well but you get to pick two different sides so we're gonna try this out and see It did take a while, so be patient, but it was really fresh. You can see the steam coming off of that chicken. It's good. I'm just not used to um, guava, chipotle, like, mixed together. It's, it's definitely like a sweet and sour. Yeah. Not really sweet and sour. It's more like a sweet and, sweet and heat, you know? Mm -hmm. <laughs> the addition of the coleslaw, I like that a lot. It's really good. Their yeah. coleslaw is really good. Okay. So if you love guava and you love chipotle, you love this sandwich. This said it's a garlic cream. It kind of tastes like sour cream. Maybe Chef Ford can try it, but and this is spicy cilantro. I actually like this. It's not spicy for me. Where's the onion and sour cream? I'll take it. It's a root plant. Is this spicy? A root vegetable. No. Not plant. Just take a vegetable. little bite. I do love the view on here. You can see the water taxi though. You can actually walk to the parks too if you want to. Yeah. It's so pretty. I like the waterfall. So they gave us this. That was really nice. And they were out of lava cake. If they are out of Trace Leachies or the other one, I'm going to cry. But they do have other places like Sorbet and things like that. So like I said, we are going to get the Trace Leches to go at the Strong Water Tavern, which is over in the lobby of the hotel that we passed. This was the food we tried the last time over a year ago. I think if I had to pick between the two restaurants here at Sapphire Falls, I would pick the Strong Water Tavern. The kids really liked their burgers, and I just liked the fun tapas. I thought it just tasted better overall. They do have some strange concoctions like the grilled octopus, but everything was really good. So I would choose that for sure. The Amatista Cookhouse was just okay. I wouldn't go back just for that restaurant. And I actually didn't know the characters met here. I know they do at Cabana Bay. How's it going? Which one? Oh, thank you. Which Dave. minion is this? Dave. Dave. Dave? Dave. Yeah. We got a birthday boy, Dave. He just turned seven today. Happy birthday. Say thank you. Jump in the pool. Perfect. Nice to see you. We'll go on your ride.
tomorrow. <coughs> yeah, we're gonna relax today. <laughs> Thank you. Bye, Dave. Say bye. Say banana. <laughs> oh, thank you. Hi, y'all. Have a good day. You too. Oh, you can see Dr. Doom. I really just love all the views from the different hotels. It is so pretty. And over there is the walkway to the park. So I'll show that a little bit later. Do you want to check? Please be like the last time. It doesn't feel as heavy. <sighs> That's still pretty big. No, the other one was as big as yeah. this. an invite to you. Okay. What? One time we had Scooby snacks. Yes, we did have Scooby snacks. Yes. And with Scooby sandwiches. So it's one of our favorites. <laughs> Alright, thank you Scooby. Have fun. Look for some clues for us. See you later. Bye. Bye. Yep. At the park. We yeah. did. We did in the game. So we went back to the room and got changed to head down to the pool. There is the arcade on the way to the pool as well. They have a decent selection. It's not the biggest hotel arcade, but it's bigger than some. And then they do have a gym. I got yelled at last time I didn't film the gym, but I feel a little weird actually doing that. And they also had a Coke freestyle machine down here. You can get free waters or pay for those refills. I would say this pool is one of our favorites because of the slide and Cabana Bay is another favorite because it has a lazy river. Most of the pool is around three feet deep. I think in the middle there it gets to over four. But just something to note if you have kids, but they also do have those life vests. It's actually nice. <laughs> yeah. There's a slide. The kids wanted to do the slide over here. You have to go up the stairs. There's also a bar and a hot tub this way, as well as a fire pit. <laughs> Good job, Pungan. Was that fun? Uh huh. Okay. Buddy Boy's next, I think. Oh. Whee! That was amazing. That was amazing? Okay. There he is. <laughs> My wife and children are swimming. It's a very nice pool. There's only one problem though, it's 63 degrees. I know the pool is heated, but when you step out, I mean, I'm freezing, I'm in my pants and I've got a blanket on and everything. Buddy wanted me to go on the slide as well, so I am next up. Go up, okay. All right. Woo woo! Woo woo! This is fun. I just used my phone to record this time with one of those protective waterproof cases, but I was still kind of scared to submerge my phone completely in the pool. I can see your feet. <laughs> hey! Hey! <laughs> it's, okay. it's okay in the water, but I know I don't want to. I don't want to step out. Oh, it's cold! It's cold! Oh wow, there's a fire pit too. All right, let's go over here. The hot tub's over here. We're gonna get in because it's cold. Ooh. Here we go. Is that better? Oh, the bubbly. The hot tub was my favorite part, especially it being so chilly. It felt great, but once I hopped back into the regular pool, it felt so much colder. Ah! Don't spray it on me. 
and we're gonna get out here in a few minutes. I'm only in here for the kids because it is freezing. The slide stopped at six and they closed at 10, so I thought that was kind of silly how they did that. I really wish it was warmer for his birthday, but it's always so cold for his birthday. The kids had a great time though. The pool is always their favorite thing to do at the hotels. Next up, we headed over to where the lobby was and that's a grab and go place, but it also has some hot items as well as gelato. They even have alcohol, lots of different drinks and sandwiches, salads, those kind of things. Gelato, that's what it is. Raspberry, cheese, mango, mint chocolate, birthday cake, Nutella. Mango, mango. Nutella? Tiramisu. Mm. Thank you. Uh, Rick and Vanessa went with the birthday cake that's their usual favorite as well as Jack loves mango and I asked whether the tiramisu or the mint chocolate was the best. The lady mentioned mint was the bomb so I went with that and she was right. I think at most of the hotels they actually do serve either gelato or ice cream but they do have these pastries, cupcakes, cookies and they also have a place for coffee as well. And I'm gonna do just a really quick tour of the store, just a quick overview. How is the birthday cake? It could be more birthday cakey, but it's still good. Mm, I wanna try mango. Wanna try this? Mmm, I like yours. Thanks. Taste it heavily. You like mine? Uh-huh. Get your own. I do have a little shop here, not a whole lot of stuff. We're gonna get more stuff at the parks though. And I got some Harry Potter and Minions. I like, I, like I like the Jaws cup too. Okay, I don't see anything too extraordinary. They don't have anything for the hotel, right? I haven't noticed anything. Because sometimes it's hard to find hotel merchandise. All of this is new. I've never seen the Deathly Hollow. I've never seen the Deathly Hollow stuff before. I kind of like. I like that. It's like a cool. It's a cool keychain. But they got a bucket hat. <laughs> I like this hoodie actually. This I didn't really see though. anything that was that hotel before. exclusive. You can find all this stuff at City Walk even or at the big shops in the front of both parks. And be careful because sometimes things like toys and action figures can be double or triple the price. We ended up going back to the room. We brought the Switches with us. I played some Super Smash Brothers, watched some TV. And since we technically ate at about two o'clock for lunch at the hotel restaurant, we ended up ordering room service. I've never actually had it look this fancy before so this was a nice surprise it was awesome oh, your that looks good. <laughs> oh yeah wow. ew I don't want to touch those eggs I got the Cobb salad, it was really good. When we ordered, it took about 45 minutes to get up to the room. Make sure you, of course, tip the person bringing up the food as well. Rick liked his sandwich, kids liked the pizza. And I think we all really just liked the room service better than we liked Amatista. Who doesn't want food delivered to their room? And the Trace Leches, we just shared between the four of us to so just try it and see if it was as good as last visit. And I just don't think it was. I mean, it was good, but it wasn't the best. And as far as the room service, I think all of the Lowe's hotels have the same kind of menu, but there are a lot of options. Even the late night options say from 11 p.m. to 6 a.m. And then this was our view at night, still really pretty. We just stayed at the Royal Pacific Hotel as well, so stay tuned for that video next, which both hotels have the perks where you can walk to the park or you can take a water taxi. Sapphire Falls is maybe a 10 or 15 minute walk. It is not bad at all and it's really pretty. We usually walk one way and then take a water taxi back. It just depends how long the line is to get the water taxi to the hotel. And last up is the breakfast buffet at Amatista, which check the hours. It's usually between 7 a.m. to 11 p.m. or 7 a.m. to 12 p.m. It is around $30 for adults and $15 for kids, so it is pricey. I remember Portofino Bay having the same price. I think Portofino Bay, we liked a few more of the options for the pastries, but basically it's the same kind of thing. You've got fruit and yogurt, oatmeal, grits, biscuits and gravy, this little area for toast, bagels. You get your own food, but they can bring out coffee for you and then they do have 
milks, apple juices, orange juice. They also had scrambled eggs, applewood bacon, sausage links, of course the biscuits, pancakes. And if you don't want scrambled eggs, they do have an omelet station. I do recommend usually waiting for that because you can get a lot more stuff in it. And then Vanessa decided to get some cereal too. They have croissants and cinnamon rolls. And I'll show the other pastries here in a second. I think they were a little short stock, so I think my omelet got a little burnt, but honestly, it was still pretty good. We got some fruit, we got meat, the kids picked out, of course, donuts, cereal, and a good mix. For the donuts, it's similar to the Simpson ones, actually. It's probably the same company, but they have a chocolate and a strawberry and a glazed one. And then on the other side, they have a few more. I believe this was some sort of strawberry croissant, and then they had an apple one, as well as a couple of muffins, a chocolate one, and banana nuts. And Rick went back to get some oatmeal. It's a good breakfast, I just think it's overpriced. I mean, maybe that's just what you get for a hotel. The eggs are okay. Okay, they're a little burnt. The bacon's actually good. I mean, it's okay. Yeah, bacon is good. I'm gonna get more of that one. Yeah, I don't think it's worth thirty dollars, but <clears throat> well, we got our money's worth in donuts and cereal for the kids. <laughs> it's yeah. like fifteen for them, I think. <laughs> this is okay. It's better than it looks. But get the donuts. The donuts we think are from Lard Lads. Pumpkin yeah, went back for another one. I hope this video was helpful. Universal is our favorite park. We have a lot of different tip and trick videos, and stay tuned for more. Play our picture, subscribe for more videos. Go to our channel, subscribe. It's up. Subscribe. Click these videos next if you want to see more hotels to stay at. We recommend these ones for sure, but honestly, you really can't go wrong with any of them. We show all the perks and amenities as usual. Thank you for watching.